Local community at college says that declining enrollment could really be bad for future of our workforce. News to ABC Spencer Tracy shows us how they're working to attract more students. For Hudson Valley Community College freshman Daniel Nelson, it's more than the art of machine theory. It's the unique hands-on experience he's getting to jump into the workforce. Benefiting me because of the fact that since this is a two-year certificate, I'm not sure if there was any other trade schools that did machinery other than like through maybe a high school. School officials say one thing that has been affecting the future workforce is the dip in enrollment for community colleges. Across the board, it's down 34 percent. In the immediate capital region at Hudson Valley, it's down 36 percent. At SUNY Adirondack, it's down 30 percent. And at SUNY Schenectady, it's down 40 percent. Because that's really what we should be doing as community colleges, is to get the skills training to those individuals who need to take it into the workforce and make things happen for them. Hudson Valley Community College offers 45 degrees, certificates, and short-term training programs. Hudson Valley President Roger Ram Sammy says it's all about forming solutions. What we have done here, we have put together a multitude of micro-credentials, short-term training that put people right into the workforce. So you find with a whole bunch of students gravitating to those. Chris Duffy, president of SUNY Adirondack, is worried about the domino effect this could have on the future workforce as many students are trading a college education for a steady paycheck. A student may find themselves in a job that may not have as much advancement for them down the road, and so higher ed gives people a more longer term view in terms of salary increases over a lifetime. Nailing down the future workforce, community colleges are offering more flexible schedules for students such as part time and shorter amounts of training. Reporting, I'm Spencer Tracy, News 10 ABC.